Oscilloscope diagnostics can be really hard, so I've made it my mission at Mechanic Mindset to make it as easy as possible. And if you want to know what people think of the training, make sure you head over to Trustpilot to check out some of the top rated reviews. So let's take a quick look at PicoScope for Automotive. So the PicoScope course basically takes you from the very basics of operating the PicoScope software including starting and stopping, all the auto features, and then your voltage and time settings. We then get onto more advanced features like triggers, setting up custom probes, and analyzing waveforms. We also have activities that go along with the videos where you can download the PicoScope waveform files and have a go for yourself. When you sign up for the full package, these are the four courses that you will get access to. As a bonus, you get access to the introduction to PicoScope 7 and Oscilloscopes Live with all Mechanic Mindset purchases. Okay, so now let's take a look inside our latest course, Automotive Oscilloscope Diagnostic. If you click this here, you can see all of the latest lesson uploads. Now this course starts from the absolute basics, starting with what is an oscilloscope. We then build on that, looking at the oscilloscope specifications, you know, things like vertical resolution. And if you don't know what vertical resolution is, it's basically the oscilloscope's ability to draw curved lines like this. Here in the red, you can see that we've got an oscilloscope with low vertical resolution, and the blue is actually a higher resolution, and you can see we've got much smoother lines. Once we've covered all the basics like hardware, accessories, and the basic setups, we then go on to all of the oscilloscope diagnostics tests. If we take a look at this lesson here, this video guides you through setting up the test for a gasoline direct injection waveform for injector current and voltage. We look at basics of the circuit layout and what that means when we look at the waveform and also what you need to look at when analyzing the waveform. We've also got the PicoScope file download for your own reference and some extra information down here and images if you were looking at it on a mobile phone for example. We also translate all of our courses into the following languages and you can just click here to turn on the closed caption subtitles. As mentioned before you also get access to the oscilloscopes live course where we will invite you to live sessions looking at real life case studies and we also invite special guests. Just recently Brandon Steckler joined us where we spent two hours discussing pressure pulse diagnostics and in-cylinder waveform analysis. In addition to this you get access to our safe community where the only stupid questions are the ones that don't get asked. It's like Facebook but without the Facebook where you can engage with me and other Mechanic Mindset members on your oscilloscope diagnostics journey. I hope to see you inside.